Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Matt from SnooCentral.org and SnoozeTV.com. Hope you guys are having an awesome day today, and like always, enjoying good snooze. Today we're going to be doing this live. I know not, not a lot of people are going to be on joining us today. Uh, probably get one or two viewers in here. But uh, my main point of this is that I do want to schedule these uh, more frequently. And... Uh, you know, get these to where people are going to actually view them at the designated times. But just to show you that um, I am going to go through with this, we're just going to do one today. So what are we looking at today? Well, none other than Thunder, I Snow You Love Me. Now, this is a really good snooze, guys, and uh, it's a phenomenal one for the holiday and Christmas time. So we just got dumped on here in Michigan, and we're going to uh, be expecting more snow tonight, right about three inches, which is not much. But heading into the weekend here, we're looking at about eight inches or so uh, by tomorrow night or starting tomorrow night. So I figured this would be a great snooze to do um, a review on and to use during these winter months. And this stuff is seasonal, by the way. So if you haven't picked this up yet, I highly suggest you guys do so before it's gone. Because this being a seasonal offering, it sells out quick, it's a popular seller, and it's something that you really have to try. So let's do a uh, live on-air review of Thunder, I Snow You Love Me. But look at this can design first off. Really nice can design here. Uh, it's got this snow an ice building up top there with the nice thunder lighting bolt in the background, the cracked thunder font, which is definitely a classic thunder font. Also, you have the I Snow You Love Me in the heart there, and it says, with the taste of gingerbread, feeling the thunder. So as you guys can see, too, on this one, it has the giant catch light up top to dispose of a lot of used portions when you're out on the go. This is something that you can use just about all day, in my opinion, without getting burnt out on it. But uh, yeah, it's a really good snooze. Also, if you want to uh, join in on the chat, please do so. Um, I'll have that chat up and running, and uh, I'll interact with you guys. So this is a really good snooze, guys. I, I highly enjoy using this one every year when it comes out. And yeah, so let's go ahead and pop one of these in right now. Oh man, that smell right out of the can. Oh, it's classic. Uh, this is definitely Christmas in your mouth. So good, guys. Got a portion here. Uh, let's look at this portion before I pop it in. As you guys can see, it's uh, typical Thunder, very nice and moist. Uh, these are a very soft portion in the upper lip as well, something that uh, doesn't cause a lot of irritation, which is good. Fluff it up a little bit here. Great stuff. Smells like gingerbread. Uh, if you've ever had gingerbread cookies, it's exactly what this is. Really good. So, by the way, guys, um, I'm going to be responding to your guys' comments towards the end of this review, uh, just so I'm not jumping back and forth and all that kind of stuff. So, stay on here if you're watching. Oh, so good. So, let's go ahead and pop this in. Man, this stuff really does take me back uh, to my childhood. Um, I have an aunt that makes gingerbread cookies every year. And man, this stuff is exactly like that. Now, the flavor profile on Thunder, I Snow You Love Me, is going to be uh, a really nice, semi-spicy, but sweet gingerbread flavor. You get that clove in there. You get a little bit of pepperiness and spice. Uh, all those holiday flavors you really want for this time of year. And man, uh, the flavor is right there as soon as you pop it in. You get those sweet tones. You get those spicy clove type of uh, tones with some gingerbread in there. Really good stuff. Um, the nicotine strength on this guy 
is a solid uh, 1.5%. So definitely a lot of uh, nicotine here, a lot of free nicotine too. V2 Tobacco knows how to do their uh, nicotine well. Uh, they know how to deliver great flavor right up front. So this is something that you can definitely use if you want to get a nicotine hit out, out of, um, but it's something that, you know, for the holidays, like I've been saying, it's, you can't beat it. It's just that really nice um, holiday flavor, you know, uh, you get, it's, it's reminiscent of a good eggnog flavor. Um, you get those spices and it mixes very well with the tobacco character that's in here too. You definitely get a tobacco character. It's not just um, gingerbread. It's tobacco and gingerbread and a little bit of sweetness, a little bit of spicy character there. And I have the big can right up there. Um, it comes in uh, 10 cans in that big can. So if you haven't picked up one of those yet, I highly suggest you guys do that because uh, for the money, it's a good deal as far as, uh, you know, 10 cans of snooze in a giant big can. And it's also a collector's item. So really cool. Now, the other snooze that they make on uh, that they pair with this uh, for the holiday or for the uh, Christmas time is Thunder uh, Frosted Christmas. And if you guys didn't see that, I did a review on that uh, last year, comparing it to Gotland Snooze Yule Snooze. So definitely check that video out, too, if you haven't looked at that yet. It's phenomenal. Um, that's a really good snooze. But this one in particular, man, uh, like I said, it really takes me back to my childhood. And this is something that, you know, you could use all day. Um, but, you know, me personally, I could use it all day. But I can see people getting burnt out on this snooze. It's not something that, you know, um, I, I think for a majority of people, you can't use it all day. But for me personally, I can use it all day, every day, until I get sick of it at the end of the season. Because uh, it's just one of those flavors that very, very good. Let me uh, pull up the chat here real quick, um, just to see if anybody's commenting yet. Um, I like to interact with you guys, you know, regularly, and I want to say thank you too for the uh, for the awesome comments on the past couple of videos. You guys have been great, so keep it coming. Uh, let's see here, just pull it up. So yeah, what have you guys been up to? Um, you know, of course these comments aren't going to be. You know, they're not going to be showing live. Well, they, they'll be showing live, but they're not going to be showing after the fact. So uh, if you can, please post your comments after the fact and let me know uh, what you guys were saying so other people can view it after this video has been posted. So let's see here. Also, if you guys... Um, been watching my videos lately. I like to know what you guys use on a daily basis, like what your top three or even five uh, snooses are to use during the day. Uh, just let me know about that as well. I like to see your guys' feedback on that kind of stuff. Let's see here if I can pull it up. Sorry for the delays, guys. So, um, if you guys use snooze on a daily basis, um, what snooze do you use on a daily basis? I'd like to know. So, for me personally, my uh, top rotation is Odin's Extra Stark. Uh, that's a phenomenal snooze. You can uh, see a review I did on that and the um, the Missouri live trip. It's a vlog that I did. Uh, we went to Missouri and uh, filmed three snooze reviews on the way there and uh, during our trip. So if you haven't checked that video out, please do so. I did the uh, o Odin's Extra Stark on that one. The... Um, uh, General Strong and the Odin's Cold. Those are phenomenal snooses. And yeah, so check those out. I don't have separate reviews of those posted, but if you want to, uh, you know, watch those in their entirety, uh, check that out. 
but anyway, yeah, I just uh, popped this in here about, I don't know, three minutes or so ago, and it's a really good snooze. The flavor is still developing, and what you'll find with this snooze uh, is, you know, it'll, it'll weave in and out of those flavors, so it'll go from that spicy character, that clove, that gingerbread flavor, to the sweetness, and then back over to the tobacco, and it just blends and mixes and, and weaves in and out of those flavors. And the flavor longevity on this guy, by the way, is a good hour in the upper lip. I haven't had any flavor degrading on this, which is good. Uh, you know, as you guys know, some of the thunder flavors can really, you know, slope down as far as that goes. Uh, as far as flavor longevity, they sort of linger out at about the 10 to 15 minute mark. But yeah, you can get a solid hour out of this guy. No problems. Um, yeah, so it's, it's a really good flavor for flavor longevity. It's something that, uh, you know, it's not going to really let you down as far as flavors go. So uh, Will Hall said, um, or Will Hall said, Grove Loose is better than all those. I'd have to agree. Um, you know, that's a great snooze if you like a loose snooze. Me personally, I'm not a huge loose snooze user, uh, but I do use it from time to time. Jotoborg's Prima Fint is one of my favorites, as well as... Um, Isla Whiskey Loose is a great one. Crafted Cardus, um, which is Connie Anderson's loose version of the Crafted Snooze Whiskey. That's a great one as well. So, yeah, pretty awesome. Um, so, yeah, uh, this is a great snooze, like I've been saying through this whole review. Sorry if I'm being long-winded long on this. But, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a phenomenal offering from V2 Tobacco. Can't go wrong with this one. Uh, if you've tried any of their uh, seasonal offerings or if you have, um, you know, a favorite seasonal offering, let me know in the comments down below after this video posted. Because like I said, uh, if you post a comment live, you're not going to be able to see it uh, after the fact. So guys, post some comments after the fact on this video. Let me know what you guys like to use in the holiday time or your top five or top two, top three favorite snooses you use during the day. Um, just let me know. Let me know what you guys like to use. So, yeah, uh, you get about, uh, let me think here, you get about 22 portions per can on this guy as well. So definitely a plenty of uh, snooze here for your enjoyment in this can. Uh, pricing varies, you know, uh, but it's a good budget snooze. Right around $350 or so a can. Um, you know, I'll have a link below down in the description box where you can pick up this snooze. It's really good. Um, Will Hale said, uh, or Will Hall, sorry, I keep saying Hale for some reason, but Will Hall uh, live said that Nick and Johnny Green Ice is good, and he's using it, that at the moment. It's a good snooze too, man. I did a review on that one. I don't remember if I did that live or not. I think I did that live, uh, but that's a great snooze. You can uh, reference that video too if you haven't watched that. Um, yeah, pretty cool. But anyway, um, yeah, really, really good stuff. I don't want to be long-winded here, guys. I want to keep this short, you know, to the point. But if you watch this video, I want to say thank you guys for stopping in uh, and watching this live stream. Again, I'm going to be posting a lot of videos in the future, a lot more snooze reviews. I'm going to get back to my day, or my weekly uh, videos of two or more. Uh, I am going to be putting out a heck of a lot of videos in this coming week, or next week, um, starting Monday or Tuesday. I'm going to be posting one a day just to get caught up. I have Odin's uh, Mint to do. I have Lenny's Stark to do. Anglo Home, those three are from GM Tobacco. I have another Lundgren's, uh, Lundgren's White uh, Perforated Portion, which is a great snooze. Um, what else do I have coming down the pipe? I have Lundgren's uh, Slim Fresh as well as their Mojito Snooze. Really good options. I'll be shooting that in the regular studio format, so stay tuned for those. And yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a quick update and a review on Thunder I Snow You Love Me. Uh, I didn't do this in front of the uh, green screen because I just wanted to mix things up a little bit and uh, give it to you in a little bit quicker fashion, even though it's live and I'm rambling. But yeah, great snooze, guys, for the holidays. Highly recommend this one. Uh, pick it up. 
It's a limited release for, uh, for the year. So it'll be around again next year if you missed out on it. But while you can, get a single can to just try it out or a large collector's can with 10 cans in the big can. Again, it's right up there. Um, yeah, really awesome stuff, guys. So thank you for watching this live stream. Again, I know it's sort of impromptu, but if you're watching this after the fact, leave some comments down below, guys. Give it a thumbs up. Give it a share. And I will see you guys on the next news review. Until next time, you know the drill, guys. Enjoy good snooze. Thanks for watching.